Welcome back to Dracon's Plays, the Wind Waker HD. Alright. We need to talk. I know I may look a bit flashy for a teacher, but I assure you, I am one. How long has it been since I opened my school here on, on Windfall Island? Twenty years? Ever since then, I've been teaching the children of this island about true joy. But I do have a rather joyless problem. There's this delinquent gang of four young boys who never listen to a word I say. Even though I wait patiently for those boys to show up, they never come. It's as if they don't want joy in their hearts. Could you please catch their leader, that little boy named Ivan, and talk some sense into him for me? Please, young man, for me. Yes, ma'am. Oh, thank you so much. You're such a dear. They're such troublesome little boys. I'm at my wit's end over how to handle them. But they won't be so mean to a boy their own age, will they? I should think not. Good luck, young man. Okay, so time to deal with the local troublemakers. Probably the local bullies, too. I wouldn't be surprised. So, Ivan. Yeah! Yo, bud. You got a problem with us killer bees, huh? Do ya? Don't tell me it's that annoying hag of a teacher again, is it? You come here to give us a talking to? Because Miss Marie asked you to, right? Tell us not to skip school, right, bud? Tell us not to be... Hardy, right, bud? Well, forget about all that. We're the mighty and invincible gang of four, the killer bees. Do you think we'd listen to a chump like you? But, I'll tell you what, bud. If you want to challenge us to a competition, then we'll think about maybe listening a little bit. What do you say, bud? You want to challenge us? I'll take you on. Okay, you're a funeral, bud. The rules are simple. You're gonna, we're gonna go hide somewhere, and if you find us, we're gonna run. You gotta try to catch us. Easy as that, bud. We won't hide indoors or nothing, and we won't leave this island. So look for us around in the shadows and behind buildings and stuff. If you catch all four of us, we lose. You got it, bud? Ready? Go! No set there? So, I got a sword. Hi, friend. I don't understand why Link just stands there and lets the kid run for the hills. I mean, he had him cornered. Okay, Paul. Hey! Not cool. Got ya. You're awesome. Thank you, friend. Time to hunt more kids while wielding a sword. Didn't want to talk to you. Where do you think you're going? Jumping off cliffs? Crazy kid. I mean, Link's crazier, but... Tingle bottle? This one can be tricky. Got ya! Well, that wasn't too bad. Gah! You got me! That's right. Oh, hi, Ivan. I see you up there. Time to get the big boy. Oh no you don't, old man. Creepy old man. Oh. Got ya, Ivan. 
Yeah, you got me. Okay. Oh, come on, Seidel, show up. There we go. Thank you. And there's the last one. That actually went surprisingly well. Whoa! That is always horribly unnerving. You're an idiot, kid. You was looking straight at me and you didn't notice me for a bit there. While I'm up here, might as well grab those rupees. Oh, now I actually have exactly 250. And got you! Ah, oh, lame! Lame sauce. Man, I can't believe it. You found all four of them. And you caught all of us, too. Talk about utter defeat. Looks like we lost our touch, killer bees. I guess maybe it's time we chill out. From now on, we won't cause no more trouble for anyone. And to reward our hide-and-seeking skills, here, take this, bud. A piece of heart. Nice. Ah, oh, this is our favorite possession. But you've proven that you're worthy. To our bud, the hide-and-seek master. Oh, and one more thing. We need you to apologize to Miss Marie for us, alright? We're counting on you, bud. Fine. I have to talk to her again anyways. Speaking of which... Well, that's an unfortunate number to have. What can I do for you this fine day? We need to talk. You did it, didn't you? You said something to those delinquents for me, didn't you, dear? You can't fool me. I watched it all from the shadow of my door. You really are a dear. You'll fill my heart with joy. I have to reward you, so here's a little spare change. And thus the teacher's now bribing the local children. Oh, and one more thing. Don't tell anybody, dear. Okay. 19 is possibly the worst number I could have. Hey, sounds like you apologized to teach for us. Good old Miss Marie. And speaking of, but did you know it's gonna be Miss Marie's birthday soon? Boss! Oh, boss! You think maybe you should give her something like some kind of present or something? Don't be stupid. We're the killer bees. We ain't no teacher's pets. Yeah, but teaches teach loves jewelry and junk more than anything in the world. What's she into these days? What's she call them? Joy pendants? Really? Where do you find them? Are they just lying around? If we could just find some, we could give them to teach as a present and she'd be all happy. Hey, now that I think about it, when I was climbing trees the other day, I saw some sparkly light up on top of some trees in town. Where was that? Maybe that's where one of those pendants are. What do you think, boss? Nah, that's crazy talk. Okay, so... 19 is a horribly unfortunate number to have because she's going to take one and then she's going to need 20. Yo, bud, looks like you found yourself a joy pen. Solid work. Actually, I gotta admit, we hit that thing up the tree. We thought you might find it. Listen up, it's gonna be Miss Marie's birthday soon. Well, we were thinking of giving her a present, so it was good that we finally got our hands on that thing. But, we can't be get going around giving presents to people. No way. That just doesn't fit the killer bee style. Come on, bud. Can't you just give it to teach for us, can you? It's not like we could ask just anybody to do it for us, neither. It's gotta be someone reliable, who can keep a secret. 
You're the only one we could ask, bud. Okay. Whatever you say. So. Go away, old man. So I'll give her this one. Unfortunately, I don't have another. I have plenty of opportunities to get it too, so that's entirely my fault. My dear, that's the joy pendant. To tell the truth, I love jewelry above all else. And that, why that is extremely rare and hard to come by. It's the hottest thing around, dear. Oh my, yes. I will happily take a single one from you. No, no, I insist. Only one. To tell the truth, I'd actually like about 20 of them. That would probably be only happened in my wildest dreams. You know, I've been a teacher here for a long time. It's tough to put one past me. That being said, I'm pretty sure I know who put you up to this, dear. Those little sweeties. I'm so joyful. It's the best birthday present I could ask for. Suppose I ought to thank you. Close your eyes, dear. And she's bribing the kids again. And if you see those boys again, tell them I say hello. So now you're going to ask for exactly 20. So I'm not even going to bother. And I don't think I have enough for the other thing. Not even close. Well then. Okay, so let's see. Anything else I can do while I'm in Windfall right now? Um, not quite yet, I think. Okay. Let's just take a look at our Tingle bottles real quick. Walden. Alright, so now we have some more sailing ahead. Let's see. Can't re Oh, I know it's directly due north of us. So, what I'll do, I'll sail here, then there, then there, then there. With my new sail, it'll be very, very nice. And if you notice, the wind automatically changes directions behind me. Which is amazingly useful. So now these ocean segments will be twice as fast. Plus, I don't have to change wind direction at all. So it'll be super fast. Alright, and I do believe I can pick up another piece of heart on this island here. Alright. Man, that was fast. I don't think I'll have to fast forward now for some of these shorter segments where I'm doing something on each island as I go. Alright. And I have plenty of rupees to be able to start this particular jump. Oh, come on, Link. Get up on... Really, Link. Thank you. Ah! Link! Okay. Sheesh. Alright. Up we go. Hey, your twin brother's on windfall. Oh. Oh, never mind. My mistake. Yeah, yeah, step right up. If you have confidence in your target shooting, why don't you give this a shot? It's 50 rubies per game. Wanna try? You bet. Alright, now then. <clears throat> oh ho ho! So, you little shrimp who thinks he's a target shooting hotshot, yeah? You say this knowing full well that we are pirates who are so frightening that crybabies shut their mouths when we step into the room. Har! 
This should be funny. Fine then, Hotshot. If you can manage to sink the five pirate ships you see on the horizon, we'll acknowledge your skill with a cannon, you shrimpy little landlubber. However, we won't tolerate any comments about how the pirate ships look like barrels. And you only got ten shots. You heard me. You can move your cannon with L and fire it with A. Watch the water plumes carefully when you fire, ya. Yeah? You got it, shrimp? I got it. If you manage to sink all five pirate ships, we'll give you all the treasure we've stolen up till now. Good luck to you, shrimp. You'll need it, ya. Yeah? Hey, look, I can shoot the fish if I really wanted to. Let's try 20 degrees. I almost hit the fish! I was actually joking about that. Okay, so. You watch, you have about two shots per thing. Which means I'm not doing horribly bad. Nice! I have four shots just for this one. Got it! Perfect! Psh, wow! Nice shooting! But we won't hand over a priceless treasure so easily, yeah? Miss! Hey, miss! Gonzo! You're at, le you're at least an honorable member of my family, are you not? So act like it. Don't lose your head. You're a talented little kid. I like you. As we promised, here's our treasure. It's yours. So take it. Yay, another piece of heart. Alright. So I believe if I win again, they give me a treasure chart. Oh, this one looks much more challenging. Let's see. Man. That one's really out there. Let's try that. Ah! Oh, wow, they are really out there. Come on. Come on, come on. Holy cow. Come on. Yeah! Alright, three shots for this last one. Bam. Yes! Psh. Wait, wait a sec. Miss! Miss! What do you want? Don't you know how to keep quiet, you scurvy dog? Oh, I was just wondering who was out here. And look at this, it's you again. Look at you and that adorable cute face of yours. I can't help but give our way our treasure to you. It's yours, so take it. Yay, treasure chart. Alright. That actually went very, very well. All right. All right, so now I just sail to that fairy island. All right. Now, I don't think I'll actually be able to get... Can I get into the fairy island? I can't remember. I do, however, believe there is a sub here. 
Let's see. Man, I forgot how nice this swift sail is. It's just amazingly fast. I mean, it's seconds to make it through. So much better. Alright. I see the fish. Oh, I know what this island is, actually. And I can get in. This one's a wallet upgrade. Which means my wallet, my bombs, and then my wallet will be at max capacity. And it's just my arrows that I'll need upgrades. Alright. While I'm here, I'm also going to grab a fairy. Because that would be very, very handy. I can now hold 5,000 rupees. Very nice. Where's the cursor? Okay, that was weird. Got one. All right. You know what? That's better. All right. So we'll grab the fish and head over to that sub. Of course, the question is at this point, where's the fish? Okay. I know he's around here somewhere. Okay, there he is. Okay. Hey, little buddy. All right, very nice. Now, I just have to locate that cell. Let's see. Where is it? Oh, hold on. I see it. Sailed in the complete wrong direction there. All right. Let's see. I am going to harvest some joy pendants. I don't even care about anything else. All I want is those joy pendants. Yep, not even going to kill you guys. I'm just grabbing your pendants. Okay. So, that'll actually wrap it up for this one. I'll see all of you guys next time. Bye! Weird turtle thing, ostrich mixture.
Oh. Are we gonna have to save Bowser? Black! <laughs> Black! Well, this guy's weird. Oh, and all of Bowser's minions. And Luigi. Sheesh. Count Black's preparations are now in order. All that remains is for the dimensional void to appear, as foretold in the prophecy. Black! <laughs> Black! <laughs> Black! <laughs> <laughs>